Hi and welcome to this Leverage Technologies Overview of SAP Harborist Cloud for Sales. There are two components to our presentation this morning. I'm going to start with a few PowerPoint slides to take us through an overview of SAP Harborist Cloud for Sales, or CRM, and James is going to go in and then actually show us the application at work. This presentation is aimed for SAP Business One customers that are looking to take the standard functionality within SAP Business One CRM and extend that through the integrated solution from SAP Cloud for Sales. So let's go through a few slides to give us some background. First of all, the customer interaction is changing. These days, with much more access to information through social media, the web, e-commerce and mobility, we're taking customers through a journey of awareness, consideration, interest and discovery. What's fundamentally changing is that with all of this information being made available to our customers and prospective customers, there's a lot more homework done by a customer prior to making contact with us about a particular engagement or product or service that we might be offering. So customers are in control of their journey. Mobility devices has major impact in this regard. Effectively, no matter what type of service or product that we're taking to market, our customers are definitely doing more research, more research on us as an organization, more research on the products we offer and what might be suitable for themselves. So digital disrupts sales. What we're seeing then is that on average, business customers are 50% of the way through their buying process by the time they make that first sales call. Prior to the days of mobility and e-commerce and social media, these customers may have simply picked up the phone and made contact with us. Now, a lot of this research is happening behind the scenes. And the real question we have to ask ourselves is, is our software, is our CRM application, is our analytics geared up for this disruption in terms of information and in terms of our sales process? So it's all about the customer experience. We want to be able to give our salespeople real-time information from a mobility device that's convenient, reliable and relevant information. Let's take an example of that. If I'm a salesperson and I'm about to walk into a meeting with my customer, I'm sitting in the car before that meeting or taking public transport, I want information about that customer. What products do they normally buy from us? What products don't they buy from us? What's currently outstanding on their account? Are there any service calls outstanding for that customer? Now, what's important is not just that as a salesperson, I can get that information, but I can get it quickly. I know it's accurate and reliable. Most likely, I can get it to a mobility device, no matter what device that is, whether I choose to use Android, Apple, a, desk, a, a notebook, whatever it might be, I can get information to it quickly, easily. So then I walk into that customer engagement, I'm well informed. So the survey says big data, little insights. We're interacting with customers on many more channels than we were 12 months ago. Customers update social media, LinkedIn and other platforms. We need this sort of information when we engage with our customers so that we are informed and we can help process all of that information to help the customer through that buying cycle and that buying journey. And the way this is relevant to CRM is we need to make sure that our CRM applications are well equipped for this transition. So what is Cloud for Sales? Today we're going to focus on the element which is Cloud for Sales. There's also Cloud for Service, Marketing, E-Commerce and other applications. But really our focus here is on things like Sales Opportunity Management, Pipeline Management, Social Media Integration. So we want to take the sales team and allow them to sell anywhere, anytime. As we talk about integration to SAP Business One, for those of our customers using SAP Business One, we're talking about then having the ability from that mobility device to automatically see what stock uh, I have available to sell to that customer, to get that customer's account information, what's outstanding on their debtors days, tight integration between SAP, Cloud for Customer Sales, and my SAP Business One ERP solution. So we want to give the salespeople the ability to know more about the customer, partly from the CRM application and partly from information drawn out of SAP Business One so that we can sell more and do less admin. 
It'd be great if we've got information about the customer, we know what stock is available to sell to the customer, we place the order and automatically the pick list appears in our warehouse, for example, and the invoice is created inside SAP Business One. So as I said earlier, we're really focused today on cloud for sales, real-time analytics, sales collaboration. But for those SAP Business One customers who want to take the standard SAP Business One service application and extend that further, there's also a cloud for service application available to us. And don't forget cloud and social engagement as well. This is what some of the analysts are saying about cloud for sales. So let's have a look at some of what's available inside Cloud for Sales. I've got integration into SAP Business One. We've touched on that earlier. So using the B1R framework, we've got this integration that allows us to check things like customer specific pricing, stock availability from within SAP Business One customer information. We've got real time analytics. So we've got elements like um, KPIs. So what is my sales forecast for the month? What is my team's sales forecast for the month? Of course, we've got all of this to a mobility device. So I'm uh, sitting outside the customer site. I can review my pipeline, for example. I can review my sales forecast. I've got full opportunity management, so lead generation. I've got integration into social media so I can see what the customer is posting to their social media accounts, for example. So a fully integrated sales and marketing CRM application at this point in time. So thank you for listening. Uh, James will take over the second part of the presentation where he'll actually now be taking the information that I've just shared with you and will be showing you SAP Cloud for Customer CRM. Thanks for watching. One last point. Don't forget, please, that there is more information available on our C4C specific website at leveragecrm.com.au. Thanks for watching.